It is time. It's time for the light round. Over. Come on, come on, come on. Play the sound. And then the lightning round is over. Are you ready, Ski? Dad, the light round comes. Let's start with Kevin in Georgia. Kevin. Booyah, Professor Kramer. Booyah. Long time fan, first time, first time caller. My Thank interest you. is in the 5G play, and that's Nokia. Symbol uh, NOK. I am hearing nothing but positives of late for the last four weeks about Nokia, and all that's happened is the stock goes down. I don't care. I think it's right to buy. There's just too much good news here. Randy in West Virginia. Randy. Hello, Jim. Booyah to all the coal miners out there watching uh, your show. I like that. I agree with you. Working hard. What's up? I'd like to know about ARLP. Well, it's one of the, the legitimate coal mining companies, and we're obviously, uh, I, for a better word, stuck with coal in Europe. I think coal is a decent price. I think they can make, I, I think the company's decent price, and I think they can make that yield. Uh, let's go to James in Louisiana. James. Hey, Jim. Thanks for the opportunity. Of course. I want to ask about SoFi Technologies. All right. Uh, you know, SoFi is very hard to reconcile because it's got great management, um, it used to trade much, much higher, but at $5, if, I, I think Anthony Noto can turn this thing around and make it have money, uh, make it a profit, a profitable company. I think we'll do it. So I'm not going to say sell the company here. Let's go to Craig in New Jersey. Craig. Hi, Jim. How you doing? I'm doing good. Well, good, Craig. How about you? Not bad, thanks. Not bad. Uh, calling about a stock that has a 31 PE, 5% uh, dividend. Uh, just calling to see if... Uh, Iron Mountain is uh, safe in Baltimore. You know what? People have tried to get me to shy away from Iron Mountain. I've been behind it because I like that uh, that dividend, which I believe is safe. I think you're okay in it. Let's go to Aaron in Tennessee. Aaron. Booyah, Jimmy Chill. Booyah. First time caller, long time listener. Excellent. I, I appreciate what you're doing for people, especially in times like this. Sure, My trying. For you is. What is your opinion on the next three to five years on Tattoo Chef? Ticker symbol That's TTC. a very hard call. It doesn't make money, and I'm not currently recommending stocks that don't make money. Now, people would say, Jim, i got to be critical here because you recommended SoFi. What I'm saying is SoFi, I don't think they don't make money. I don't think it's going to go much lower. Now, we're going to Peggy in Pennsylvania. Peggy. Hi, Jim. Hey, Love Peggy. the show. Been Thank watching you. it since March of 2005. Love your accent. Uh, nice. I feel at home. What's up? I'm calling about a fertilizer stock that is down 63% since ag peaked in the middle of April. Uh, red candles on all the, all the ag charts, but this one's really bad. Um, it also sells input to the oil and gas industry for drilling and fracturing operations. So should I buy, sell, or hold my intrepid potash, symbol IPI? I am very worried about that industry because I see the prices of corn and wheat be going down and soy. No one talks about the stuff that's good that's happening inflation. There's obviously some inflation that we have to get rid of, but not in commodities. They have all come down. Let's go to Anthony in my home state of New Jersey. Anthony! Jimmy, what are you thinking of CRISPR these days? That's uh, a good I didn't action. like you know, the, the read yesterday was so-so. It was so-so, and people didn't like it yesterday. It's up five. Now, I want to say longer term that this is one of the few companies that I have felt uh, represents the real technology of the future. This is you know, more of a Kathy Wood, Jim Kramer, not usually confused with each other. So I'm not going to bet against anyone who wants to be part of CRISPR technology because it could be great. Now we go to John in California. John. Salutations from Fresno, California. Oh, I love Fresno. My doctor, one of my doctors just moved there. What's going on? Uh, I've old, owned Berkshire Hathaway for 30 years. Should I continue to hold? Buy Absolutely. Or sell? Absolutely. The, the, the assets are great. I know the chart's not great, but the assets are terrific. How about Mike in California? Mike, Mike, Mike. Oh, no, that could be the end. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is the conclusion of the Lightning Round. The Lightning Round is sponsored by TD Ameritrade. Don't miss a second of Mad Money. Follow at Jim Kramer on Twitter. Have a question? Tweet Kramer. Hashtag Mad Tweets. Send Jim an email to madmoney at cnbc.com. Or give us a call at 1-800-743-CNBC. Miss something? Head to madmoney.cnbc.com. Shepard Smith here. Thanks for watching CNBC on YouTube.